Okay, so uh, I think we're, I guess we're on the top here, Roy Levire. Um, yeah. So, uh, so uh, uh, they all have to do with Ava, the Purim have to do with Ava and Bittu Hara. So Roy Levire feeds the Ech Matim, is there Shadi Ne Purim? Okay, how do you have the Purim make a film with this? Come on, Kriya Samagila, Mukhotim Chet. She said, I'm Dafka or Oma. Where is the Ava? So be advised. Purim is the Bukhina of a small world, a miniature world. Everything which happens in the course of the 6,000 years of the greater world, it's got to be in a miniature condensed into Purim. This world is like the hallway, the foyer before the four Olam Abba. All the loss, he love all, all the eventual future. Bitla yetsar, the yetsar is negated. She yetsim sapich latov. How does it yetsim yetsim no mazed? This will all be uh, uh, emerge out of this world. The Moshe Amru hapasuk mi tain tar mi tamei. Who's going? Who who produces tar from tamei? All the mabah mi all the mazed. All the mabah all the mazed kula choshech. All the mabah kula or mi choshech yotz ze yotz ze or. Specifically, out of the cheshach of this world, the 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 uh, the light comes as a czar, with czar, which Sora quotes a lot, which says that lake on the hora kahid and nothing migol There's the um the 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 there's no light like the light which comes out of darkness, and there are two ways of understanding that, which is one of them is that the light at the end of a dark tunnel is very very sweet and powerful. And the other is that the light, it's not the light at the end of the tunnel, but it's light which is uh, fabricated from the darkness. In other words, the darkness is the strands of thread by which you create the light. And the second shot is more is deeper and is actually, I think, what he's referring to here. Um, he says, uh, uh, there was a um, there was a light which came out of his head. They asked him, "How did you merit this light?" See, Perry, he related. The uh, uh, the um, uh, there was uh, there was a typer for this woman, and she busted her door when she came to his hand. She rebuked him, and he re. re he conquers Yetzar. Umizeh mishvira sa Yetzar. Me alotin af Yetzar or. So from the cheshech of the Yetzar comes out the or. Rather moshek mos she or gashmi motzi me a cheshech. And the obviously it doesn't work that way in this world, but it was it's as if the uh, uh, a uh, material light comes out forth from darkness. Bevikugal shemosh malachim matar mekoma b'shemayim. Is the place to in heaven or to be given to earth? Not Sach Moshe Deitan or so. Moshe was victorious by Taina. She ain't Shach Malachim Lotir Tzach Lotinach. By Malachim, it's not Shach Lotir these these Lavin. Kidafka mich, which means Kidafka Michoshech Olam Aze Yoytze Or Veil Motzach. You need a Choshech Olam Aze to get that Or, and there is no other source for that Or. All the radiance, yeah, the whole das is basically about that. How it's kind of, uh, how the uh, uh, light of all the darkness of Olam Hazeh is a necessary a precondition and uh, the source for the light of Olam Haba. It's simply a place where there are travails and suffering. Shamu Matsmiach Yeshua, Matsmiach Yeshua, there is the uh, seed from which the Yeshua is, uh, grows. Bisokado, it's a great principle. She calls them to Shedeu. Everybody says no. She mishvira sa yetsa makabal on them or from breaking the yetsa, a person gets light. The whole call of them a matsaba like Yeshua's. The person gets feelings. She feel a mishvira sa yetsa kalo, even when breaking a small yetsa, like Yeshua can find no unbelief rule. He feels uh, ple- uh, uh, a, sen- a sense of satisfaction or uh, spiritual pleasure, which is limitless. The more a person breaks the 
feels more of this pleasure. If he breaks the Kabli, then the Yetzar becomes for him a special friend. And the opposite. Meaning, when he listens to the Yetzar and he uh, he um, he he uh, um, um, pampers it, pampers it. He's really raising an enemy to himself. And his end will be uh, um, to wilt away. A very p- p- basic principle in the world, world of the Yetzirah. It's not in other words. In other words, the person who is uh, who is defeated hates with intense hatred the person who is victorious. It becomes a complete friend and loved one to the person who breaks it and cancels it. And the purpose of this war, which emerges from this war, when I say, oh, of she becomes his, his, soul, his soul's companion. Each one became of him a good friend. He built him the secret of the Torah. His quality was the secret of life to stop plagues. And actually, they tell me, in other words, how the, the Malachamavis told Moshe Rabbeinu, this is how you save people from me. It would seem that it be more appropriate. And why would the Malachamavis want to give away the secret? Maybe another Malach should give it them, but not 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 the Malach Hamavis. Well, we have such but this is the principle which we have explained. She saw the chayim bought dafka mi Malach Hamavis. The secret of life comes specifically from the Malach Hamavis. Can you It's the truth. She mechemes a yitzer yotze shay yotze she mi mechemes a yitzer. From the war against the yitzer, yotze it comes shay yitzer mi sapech l'toyev. The Malach Hamavis at small. The achoyshech yotze chayim bor. When Hashem is uh, happy with a person's pathways, also his enemy will make peace with him. Avram made peace with his Yetzirah. Avram who, who, who embittered and, and tortured himself. I'm not sure how we know that, but in any event, who Shlimim Yitzroh. Eventually, he was able to make shalom with his Yetzirah. Sha'etzer nasa o'avo. Mitzvah's poor in Aloy, mitzvah's bitter or rough, Moshe Maru. Ma'alach has varim well derech zeh. This is the way it works. Midchil tzach liyos hor homon. Tafka oror, oror meshukats gli kates. So in the war against the Yetzirah, initially Yetzirah has to be cursed and repudiated, repugnant, without limit. Baruch Maru ha'gan ke'n gli kates of war. Without any limit and, and, and boundary, a war in all of its uh, strength. Baruch Marcha against Oroman. Not giving up even a hairbreadth. The Zoe Mitzvah says, Shemachia Samolek. When you complete the war successfully, if you shaber Yetzogamri, then the Yitzhara was destroyed. Hatach, it will be broken. Hatach, the Yitzchak, as though she has said, slow, ad lo yada. The purpose is to make ad lo yada. Tach, it's a Muhammad, she has said, and I say, oh, wait. Was ink for Orohaman. So, ad lo yada, ben Orohaman, the Baruch Marachai means the Yitzhara became for you now, at the end of the process, and oh, wait. So, there's no difference between Orohaman and Baruch Marachai. Both the uh, both uh, both of them are being used for the shame for, for, for the, the for the shameless of a person. Uh the ultimate evil becomes good. And that's how the day progresses. which is about the midst of the Suda, which is the Adlo Yoda. <laughs> so 
So Yoytze Azla Yoza until after Kriyasa Megillah, which is a Chiddush Lalacha, but okay. The Dafka Mikriyasa Megillah, specifically from me Megillah, Me Oro Hamon, Umacho Amche, Misham Yoytze Azla Yoza. From there comes out to Azla Yoza. It's by Mechoem Che, by vanquishing the Yetzer, then the Yetzer also is mashing with you and you can use it with Shem Shamayim. And this is the ultimate purpose. So I, I, I don't remember if I mentioned this last week, but the, the according to uh, Rabbi Surah Salanter, so Yetzer told me Yetzer uh, sometimes uh, um, um, used to uh, as metaphors for the intellect being the Yetzir Tov and the emotion being the Yetzir Hara. And B'chol of Avecha, to serve Hashem with both the Yetzir Tov and the means to use both the intellect and the emotion uh, properly. And that's usually, that's the way to do that is by, if possible, the intellect governing the emotion. And so it's Chiyosh and Mus is that it might not work so well and you have to use emotion to govern the emotion. So it's because our intellects are weak. But in any event, the point is that if a, a, a emotion is dangerous, and that's why it's the Yitzhahara, it's not intrinsically evil, but it's it's dangerous. So the it, a person has to first train his emotions that they should not be used for the wrong purposes, and then those emotions can help him in his pr- pursuit of uh Hashem and the pursuit of Shlemus. So then the uh, the Adlo Yadah is that when you can use intellect and emotion in one one conglomerate entity. So that, in order to do that, first you have to have make sure that your emotions are not leading you astray, and then you can use it together with your intellect. That's what I think he's saying. Something along those lines. At least that's the way I understand it. Very good. Okay, one of the next piece is also going to go back into also about Purim. Uh, it looks like another issue, but it looks interesting. Okay. Uh, All right, very good. Next week, I have um, parent teacher conferences Tuesday night. Okay. So, uh, if we can, learn, if you want to learn another night, we can learn another night. Otherwise, we'll we'll skip. Another night is fine. Just send me a text. Yes, I'll, be, I'll be in touch. Okay. Okay, great. Have yes. a good night. Goodbye. Yes, you too. Take care. Thank you.